that's what she's doing. He gave her the idea. What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to The Princess Guide. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next upload. And if you'd like to support the channel, we got channel membership, Patreon, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to The Princess Guide episode 3. Yeah, the show's getting good. It totally reminds me of Realist Hero. And that time I got reincarnated as a slime. And all these other isekai shows. But it's unique on its own. They got like a bit of mystery in there. Catching my attention. They got a bit of intrigue. Making me want to know more. Like the backstory of these characters and such. And it's... Especially with Wayne, where he shows some dark side to him. I love it when a character, you know, shows like such a nice kind of goofy side. And all of a sudden, they just get dark. Mm-hmm. I like that. I like that contrast. Wait. Are they wearing uniforms? Is this back at the academy? Do or die was baked right in. They kind of have similar hairstyles. Like one side of her hair is longer than the other, just like him. Yep, that was the military academy. So we're going to see that classmate. Probably in this episode. Three Imperial Princesses? They have arrived ahead of schedule? Don't tell me that classmate from the academy is... the friend. I mean, is the princess. And in marriage? Well, we, we, we should have seen this coming. We should have. It is the friend! It's the friend! A trap! <laughs> And she's the second princess. <gasps> Nim -nim, how could you say that? Oh, 
Plots and schemes. <laughs> Guarantee she knew who you were beforehand. Yeah, why would she want to get married to him? Mm. You did meet resistance. I feel like she's revealing what her situation is. Oh, she, oh, he interpreted it. I feel like this is like royal code talk. What did he send? Two chest full of things. It was cold talk. Let's get to the real talk. <laughs> Plumped up except for her boobs. <laughs> You're more feminine. <laughs> The butt of all things, the butt. <laughs> oh, she exerted authority. Ooh, did she? <gasps> she did! Ooh. 
That was a bit of politics talk, slash frenemies talk. Yeah, what's your true objective? Seize the empire with her? How? Three princes, one princess? Thrilling situation. <laughs> Uber thrilling. Cool conspirator. <laughs> Yeah, what's your ace in the hole? What? There are layers in this episode. Layers and layers. Oh! Why do they look similar? I like how they're adding the sister part. They could have taken this out, but they kept it. I like it. Mm-hmm. She's just giving you the tea. Mm-hmm. <gasps> They're on that topic. We and Ninim getting together. Are they going to explain what a flam is? Oh. 
Is it mutual then? Are they having like girl talk? <laughs> yeah, where's Glenn and Strong? Where are those two? What were they? Were they from another kingdom too? A duel? What kind of duel? Noble seeking her attention. Ooh! Gerard? Gerard? I wonder if he's involved in this episode. Oh? Antagalata. Antagalto. How do you say that? Oh, that was mentioned again. Greatest charlatan? His son is the second generation. So Gerard is the third generation.
Oh, flashback. Is it just me or is the subtitles off? Your family won't let you do anything unladylike. Oh, she, he read her. He's been reading her from the beginning. <gasps> he put the idea in her head. Start a war? Male chauvinism. The future can be changed. So Wayne knows what she's trying to do. Oh, she asked if he would help. And he said no! Oh, he said ahead of time that he would probably bail. Why not just drag us in without asking? That's what she's doing! He gave her the idea! He totally gave her a way to drag him in. This is premeditated somehow. Wayne has to remember this conversation. He remembers it. He has to have remembered it. And that's my reaction to The Princess Guide, episode 3. Bruh, I was not expecting that ending, that little flashback. Oh my goodness, there's like so many layers of meaning behind words, bluffs over bluffs. And it turns out that whatever Wayne was speculating it was something that they talked about while they were in the academy 
So he was trying to figure out what she was trying to do. It wasn't a marriage. She said that she wants to take over an empire. Or, yeah, take over the empire. And they mentioned that place called Aunt, Aunt Galtal. Like, how do you say that? <laughs> I'm going to have to look that up later. But anyways. And it turns out that Loa really does want to be the empress. I mean, if she's going to wage war, she must want to be the empress. She wants to rewrite the culture of the empire. She doesn't want to marry Wayne, <clears throat> but she wants to go into war with Wayne. He, she wants to bring him in. She already proposed it. So I guess that was like a formal thing. And she knew he was going to say no. She knew per their conversation back in the academy. So she's like, okay, well, I'm just going to drag you in like you said I can <laughs> or I should. He didn't say she could. She, he said she should. <laughs> And that's exactly what she's doing. She's dragging him in. And I think she's going to make it so he can't bail out. Because didn't Wayne say that if he can't find a way to escape, I guess he'll have to be involved. I'm, I'm assuming that's what he meant when he said he couldn't, if he couldn't bail out. I'm wondering if Wayne remembers this conversation. Did he know about this conversation from the beginning as soon as he saw her? And is he prepping for it? Like when his person brought in the weapons, say, oh, we found these weapons. They're not ours, but they're new. Is that when it clicked for Wayne? Or was it when they were talking about the war where Law proposed to join forces? And take over the empire. Now I'm wondering if that plays the Marquis of Aunt, Aunt Galtal. A-N-T-G-A-T-A-L, right? That's how you spell it. I'm wondering how that place is going to be involved. And what about the other friends? You know, the other two guys? I'm wondering if they're going to show up in the next episode. Me, yeah, enough of me talking about this. What did you guys think about this episode? What did you think about this video? I know that, like, the audio and the subtitles was kind of off. Yeah, like, it was a little jarring for me. Not gonna lie. <laughs> and I tried refreshing it, and that didn't change it. It did not. But besides that, uh, let me know what you guys thought in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash Superfana. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lehua, and this is the Superfina channel. Reacting to the Princess Guide, episode 3. Hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you on the next one. Laters!